Hello friends, welcome back to another session of Tikha Tarka. I am Daisy and today I am going to show you Silky Rizgod. The recipe creator is my husband Vinay Kumar and I will voice over the process. Let's note the ingredients first. Let's start. First of all, clean the rizgod. Peel off the fibers if it is there and pat it dry with the kitchen towel. Cut the rizgod into pieces like this. Take chickpea flour or basin in a big bowl. Add corn flour and rice flour. Add salt, turmeric powder, half of red chilli powder and half of black pepper powder. Mix them well. Now add water to make a thick batter. Add water little by little so that lumps will not be there. My husband's recipe is great but he is not great at stirring and mixing. Now we are going to fry the rizgod pieces, so heat enough oil in a pan. When the oil is smoky hot, add the rizgod pieces and fry it for 2 to 3 minutes and take it up. Dip the rizgod pieces in the batter and add it to the pan one by one. As we know rizgod cooks very fast, so we will fry it on high flame. We have to fry the pieces crispy, so make sure you turn the pieces and fry it from both the sides. See, rizgod pieces are fried. These are very crispy and tasty. You can also serve it as an evening snack with tea or sauce. Now we will prepare masala for this recipe. For this we have taken tomato, ginger, onions, garlic, carrot and radish. For this heat some oil in a karai and add garlic and chopped green chilies. Fry it for a few seconds and add other things one by one. Add the things in the sequence I am showing here and cook it for 2 to 3 minutes. Make sure you add the tomatoes in the last as we don't want to cook the tomatoes.
add little salt and black pepper powder and cook it for another 2 to 3 minutes. As it is done now, we can transfer it to a mixy jar and grind it to a fine paste. See the masala paste is ready now. Now heat the remaining oil of the fried risgot and add some cumin seeds. Let it splatter and add the ground masala paste. Keep stirring so the masala does not stick to the water. Add little salt, keeping in mind we have already added some salt to it. Now add toasted coriander and cumin powder, mix it well. After cooking it for 2 to 3 minutes, add the fried risgot pieces and mix it well. We have fried the risgot pieces but they are not completely cooked. So here we want our risgot pieces to cook till soft and absorb the flavor of the masala. 
so for that we will put the lid on and cook it for 3 to 4 minutes on very low flame remove the lid we can see the masala and the red good pieces are very well cooked now we can add some water to make a thick gravy Mix it well and cook for 2 to 3 minutes on high flame to make a consistent gravy and switch off the flame. Silky Rizgod is ready now. We can serve it hot with chapati, puri or rice. How did you like this recipe? Please leave a feedback in the comment section. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel Tikha Tadka for more recipes. Thank you.